Nandishwara, he is not interested in becoming, you know, Indra or Brahma or Vishnu. I am not interested in liberation also, O Mahadeva. I am not interested in the Ashtasiddhi or becoming the leader of the Ganas. Yadi Pritosi, then what he wants? Yadi Pritosi Bhagavan, Nanu Krosha Tayamama, Anugrahyo Hyaham Deva, Vayavashyam Suradipa. Yetanyena Bhavet Bhaktis Tvatto Nityam Maheshwara Tataham Bhakti Michami Sarva Bhuta Shayetvaye. Oh Mahadeva, if you are pleased with me, see this should be the attitude of a devotee. No, only by Mahadeva, Mahadeva should be pleased with you. Hmm? And then only you can get the favor from him. And what he asks for, please give me that kind of devotion which will make me worship only you and no one else. Example of Shiva Eko Yeyaha. Shiva alone should be worshipped. Nandishpara says that I don't want to worship anybody. Give me that kind of devotion where I will worship only you and no one else. Sarva Bhuta Sarva Bhuta Shayetvayi Tataham Bhakti Nichami Yata Anyena Bhavet Bhaktir. I don't want to worship the Anya Devatas. I don't want to devote myself to them like Indra, Brahma, or Vishnu. I don't want to worship them. I want to worship only you and no one else. Give me that kind of devotion. So what, what kind of a boon? See? Uh -huh. So this kind of, you know, this level of surrender, we can also achieve this level of surrender, but only by doing sadhana. Importance of sadhana is, you know, clearly how, you know, he has during the time of summer, Nandishwara has five fires around him and then he worships uh, standing on one leg and during winter he stands in cold water and worships. You know, we don't want to do that. But you know the importance of sadhana because our mind is like a monkey. It keeps going here and there. It keeps thinking of all the materialistic things. It keeps thinking of all the perishable things. One has to aspire for the imperishable. One has to aspire for the, you know, if you go, uh, one has to aspire to go beyond the repeated cycles of birth and death. That is the purpose of human life. What is the use of being born as a human then? The human alone is given the sixth sense. Animals are not given the sixth sense. The animals, you know, just imagine if we are born as a dog or a cat. We don't even have the chance to think of who are we and who is the Supreme Lord and what is my relationship with him. Because that is not given, the animals are not given the sixth sense, only five senses are there. So the human is given the sixth sense to engage in thinking who am I and who is Mahadeva, who is that supreme reality that is Mahadeva and what is my relationship with him, Pashupati Pasham. Uh, so it's very very important to engage in some kind of sadhana, only by strict sadhana our mind will not be attracted to the materialistic things and it will be focused only on that Supreme Reality Mahadeva and it will focus all the thoughts related to how to attain the Supreme Reality will come to our mind by strict sadhana. Hmm? Engaging in Bhakti. We can start off with 10 minutes. Huh? Okay, 10 minutes I'll chant Namashivaya Mantram every day. 10 minutes every day. And it should be like Ahaituki Apratigata. Apratigata means unbroken. Okay, I have worshipped Mahadeva, I have worshipped, I have done sadhana for a month. Okay, let me take rest for another month. No, unbroken. Bhakti is unbroken devotional service. Ahai tuki, no, with no expectation. If you expect something from Mahadeva, and that, that is not bhakti. That is vyabari. You make him, you make him as a vyabari businessman. Oh, I do these things. Okay, you have to do in return. And Mahadeva knows what is running in your mind because he is in the heart of all the living entities. So, if it is true bhakti, he will give you. He will send you a proper vaidika. Guru, he will send you a proper Guru from a Vaidika Shaiva Sampradaya and you will get, you can get initiated in that Sampradaya. But your Bhakti should be true. Ahai Tuki and Apradigata with no expectation. Like we see our Nandishwara, even after Mahadeva appears in front of him, he gives a big list. Oh child, what do you want? You want to become Brahma, Vishnu or Indra? Let me know. Huh? Right now, I can make you. Like the Skanda Purana, there is a place, you know. Indra had to leave his place. Uh, for a person who was engaged in Shiva but his devotion was not like Nandishwara. He just worshipped casually Mahadeva and for that he gets the post of Indra and the current Indra had to leave. 
like that so you know oh child what do you want i can make you indra brahma and vishnu right away crores and crores of indras and brahmas and vishnus are there you know அப்பர் திருநாவுக்கரசர் சேஸ் நூறு கோடி பிரம்மர்கள் நொந்தினார் கோடி நாராயணர் அங்கனே ஏறு கங்கை மணல் என்னில் இந்திரர் ஈரில்லாதவன் ஈசன் ஒருவனே 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 ஈரில்லாதவன் ஈசன் ஒருவனே